Hello and welcome to today's daily vlog. Now, I'm going to take Molly for a walk early this morning. It's not not early early, but I think I'm just going to get on. It's currently it's just gone quarter past eleven. Something I can get down to the um, the dog walk near the ground that goes around that industrial estate. I'm gonna take around there this morning. Um, try and get there before 12, before people start getting there. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna head down there now. I'll take her in the garden first. And then um, head down there, give her a walk, and then come back. Um, I just wanna go and get it done really quick. So I'm gonna leave the camera here and um, I'll carry on the vlog when I get back. And we're now back. Um, we had a good walk. Molly is now down here with her blanket. It's my old um, Chicago Bull towel, beach towel that I, um, I used to have when I was at school. I used to be really into like basketball and and that. And I had that. Um, I had all the Chicago Bulls um, stuff like. Um, the Michael Jordan vest, Scotty Pippen vest, um, and he's played basketball quite a bit. I was never really any good, but I used to give him my best shot. Um, she just likes to um, have it down there, just so she can curl up with it. But um, yeah, um, I want to log on for a bit. Um, I'm gonna have a bit of this yogurt. It's the cherry one. We haven't been able to get the raspberry ones for ages. Um, so now I get two cherry ones um, each week. Um, but yeah. So, um, like I said, I'm gonna log on for a bit. And I need to get some. Um, Sweet cones made up. I need to get the get the weighing machine from downstairs so I don't weigh out. I see what 150 grams looks like in the um, in the cones, and then if it doesn't look like very much, then I'll probably sell them at 200 grams. 200 grams is like two pound each or something. Um, but yeah. Anyway. Um, Let's go online. So it's just gone quarter past six. Um, it's 18 minutes past. Um, Molly is having a yawn down here. <clears throat> hey. <laughs> and I think I'm going to get started with the... Um, Making up the sweets, sweet cones on Monday. Um, didn't really get a chance to do any today. Um, I want to get some bits made up and then sort of figure out what size boxes I need. Uh, I think I'm just going to do one size of box because I don't think people are just going to buy one or two items over the internet. Um, I think people are gonna sort of like I think people are more likely gonna buy like a month supply. So that they're basically not spending loads on postage. They can buy like a month supply and then get um free postage. So that might be the way that people might want to buy. Um but we'll just have to see how things go and how people want to buy sweets. Um, I think my English sweets might have um, Americans might actually want to buy the um, the English stuff. English people might want to be more America go for the more the American stuff, and Europeans and. Um, 
that might want to go for a bit of both. Um, but then it all depends with um, Brexit and everything and how. Um, I think my friend in Romania, she said because um, of Brexit there's um, tax on postage and everything or something. And um, because of that people might not might not buy from like places like that. But we'll see. Um, anyway, I'm going to go online now. I'm going to let my dinner settle. We had um, pizza tonight. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go online, let my dinner settle. And um, go and watch EastEnders and everything. It's going to be a good one tonight because um, Whitney walked out the house um, in a bad mood. I think she's gone and going over to um, the Mitchell's house, and hopefully, um, <clears throat> the um, start of this episode was sort of like continue on right from where that left left off. Last night's episode left off. Um, I was kind of hoping that um, last week, when um, or earlier the earlier in the week when um, Kush. Um, had his last scenes. I was kind of hoping like the next episode was going to be like Whitney finding him, but um, it wasn't. It was um, <laughs> it started like a couple of hours after. I think it was like the next morning. I think that's when it started. It started like the following morning after. So you're kind of having to make up your own mind like how he was found and how what kind of. where it went from there there's a bit of a gap <clears throat> but then saying that they might have left that gap because they're gonna have like a flashback episode or or something when they did the um who killed um lucy beale they had a flashback episode for um for that they basically recalled her movements around the square on the on that night and how other people moved around after the actual um the character that um killed her was revealed it was like um it was like a flashback sort of episode that was um specially made to show sort of like the um like the background of what you didn't actually see um when it actually happens, but um, yeah, anyway, like I said, I'm gonna go online, and let my dinner settle, and then we're gonna watch EastEnders and everything later. So it's now about 20 to 11. Uh, I'm gonna do this bit of washing up. I've just watched EastEnders and the news, and um, an episode of Top Gear that I taped from. Um, Dave, like a couple of weeks ago, I've got like Top Gear one record like all the time. I think you, I think I've taped it on BBC One, but because it's Top Gear, it's automatic taping it off of Dave as well. Dave is like the um, channel that it gets repeated on, so it's like the really old um, episodes back when Clarkson and Hammond and May were um, hosting it. Um, but yeah, Molly is down here currently. <laughs> and I haven't really done anything towards the sweet shop today. Um, I'm gonna get on with it over on Monday. I'm gonna get back out in the um, garden tomorrow and do some more work on the um, raised bed. Get some more of that done. Um, I'm hoping that I can get um, that last bit of soil out and start to actually level it off. Then I need to roll out the um, the weed membrane to complete what I've done along this sort of like section of this wall that is running down here. So I need to um, finish off that way, cut the um, the weed membrane and lay it so it goes like 
that way and then dig all that bit, last bit of soil out and roll it that way so it goes towards the back of the garden um, into that area where the raised bed's going to go um, and then I'm going to get some people in to come and do the um, slabbing but then I'm going to um, I'll probably try and get them to um, put weed membrane into the slabs that way they're not going to be growing through the cracks because um, obviously I've got the sweet shop to maintain and keep going I've got the um, the project that's I'll tell you more about when we, that's going to happen in, in the shed um, but yeah thought I'd turn that off Um, so yeah, so I need to like roll it out, cut it that end, roll it to the back. No, cut it, roll it to that end, complete the end that I've done, cut it, pin it down, cut out, cut out, dig out the um, last bit of soil, roll it up to the back of the towards the back of the garden, pin it down that way, and then lay the um, sleepers. Um, and then that's all done. And then basically do the raised tier bit in the corner and then fill it up with soil and um, compost and basically um, do it all um, like that. So it's gonna all gonna be good and um, dusted soon. Um, and then hopefully by the end of this summer we'll have the shed in. Um, but it's now 10 to 11. Um, not really going to be doing much else other than this bit of washing up and then editing this video. So I'm going to end today's video here. So if you like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, leave a comment, and click the bell so you always get notified when I upload new videos. And I'll see you on Tuesday at 6 pm. So don't forget if you dream it, believe it, achieve it. Good night.